welcome back to my channel. Right now, I'm applying some foundation powder to the front of my wig just to make it look a little more realistic and it'll be able to match with my skin tone. I did have a video of me taking the wig out of the packaging and showing you what that looks like straight out of the packaging, but I lost the footage. This wig does have two combs in the front, one comb in the back with adjustable straps. I find this wig to be slight, uh, a little bit small for my head, but I made it work. Like always, the links will be down below if you would like to purchase this unit and you think it's cute. Go ahead and purchase this wig, girl, because it is bad. Wait till you see it. This wig has me on my grown and sexy, okay? Like, look at the cut. Look, just look at it. It just is popping. So, what wig is this that I have on today? This is the Big by Model Model, and it's called Bubble Metal. I have it in the color 1B. Guys, this is what the stock card looks like. I really wanted to get this wig in the color that she has on in the stock card photo, but they did not have that uh, wig in the color in stock so I just was like let's just go with a natural look and we just gonna go with a 1B. So that's what I did and I want to thank Divatrice for sending me this lovely wig to do a review on. Thank y'all. I appreciate you guys so much. You seen in the beginning that the wig has two combs in the front, one comb in the back with adjustable straps. I didn't adjust the straps whatsoever. All I did was put some powder um, under the lace so I did not pluck it. Um, all I did was put some powder there and kept it moving and I pushed some hair back and kept this little piece out that's all I did and kind of you know just play with the curls a little bit but other than that I didn't do anything to this wig like pluck, pluck the part sorry I didn't pluck the part I didn't do anything manipulate this wig I didn't cut it whatsoever this is it straight out the pack I do not have my hair braided down under this wig just because I haven't been able to find somebody to braid my hair down in school it's been really hard so I'm really just about to learn how to Throw some little pigtails or something in there. So my hair is in the ponytail under here. So I'm going to turn to the back. So where y'all can see the back. I hope it don't look bad back there. Because I have no clue. Um, you know if my hair is sticking out or anything. This is a cute everyday little bob. Like this is a cute everyday wig. I will wear this everyday. Um, I will wear this if I'm going to. A glam event with a nice dress off the shoulder fur as I'm wearing right now but y'all this is a beautiful beautiful wig I love everything about it um I don't know well yeah it does say that it's curling iron safe so you can put heat on this but I don't see a, a need to put heat because the bang is already you know popping and then the curls are already popping so why would you want to put heat to this but either way either way it goes i love everything about this one and i just really want it in this color you guys i want it in this color it does have ear to ear lace the lace is very natural looking it's not a hard lace it's more of soft lace and the hair has a The hair has a yakky texture, but it is soft as well, and it does not have a lot of shine to it. You don't have to add any powder or anything to this wig. It's already looking good. So, so 